Hi, my name is Michelle and I'm on the Dexcom care team. I'm here today to help you learn more about your Dexcom G6 continuous glucose monitoring system. In this video, we're going to review the various reports within Dexcom Clarity. When you log into Dexcom Clarity, you will be able to view your reports and identify your trends and patterns in your glucose data. This information should be very helpful in improving your diabetes management. The first report you will see in Dexcom Clarity is the overview report. It shows a glucose summary dashboard, a pattern summary, and your best glucose day for the date range selected. Review the metrics to prepare for your discussions with your healthcare provider. Then we encourage you to check out the patterns report to see patterns in your glucose data. You should locate your lows first and then consider things like your basal rates, the amount of insulin taken with meals, your correction factor, how often you're taking insulin and if you're potentially overcorrecting, and if you're going low after exercise. If Dexcom Clarity hasn't identified any patterns, take a look at your trend report to see your glucose trends during different times of the day. To help explain your glucose data, print out your report and mark it with your usual times for walking, breakfast, lunch, dinner, sleeping, insulin, exercise, and snacks. Lastly, you should review your daily report to see if there are groups of time that you are low or high. Notice if the groups of time occur on weekends, after exercise, during special activities, or around mealtimes. You can access all of this and more on the Dexcom Clarity app. Download it from the App Store for access to reports, notifications, and more. Still have more questions? Then we encourage you to visit Dexcom.com forward slash FAQs for additional help.